Hey everybody, so I am here with another edition of Karen Fry, and I am here with my friend Evan, who can't wait to you because he's filming me. Hey Evan. Hey. Okay, so Evan is a big green tea matcha guy, and he gets green tea matcha in my house. So I told him the next time he gets green tea matcha, I'm going to try it with him. So I am out with Evan. Um, I'm not going to say the name of the place we're at in case I don't like this. Um, <laughs> but I am giving it a try green tea matcha. So it's my first time. And I tasted earlier, they have green tea matcha ice cream. Um, that was an interesting experience because it's a little sweet. It's a little bitter, but it's more on the bitter side of the sweet. But it's, it's, like, it's like my ex-wife. Oh my god. Okay, I work alone here. So, I decided to get a frappuccino, because who doesn't like a frappuccino? Because you can totally make a frappuccino work. Oh my god, your camera work is hilarious. Okay, so I got a green tea, not your frappuccino, and then also, we had these awesome cream puffs. Look at that. Oh, good, good, good. Okay, so we got green tea. Um, cream puffs, we got green tea, matcha frappuccino. So I'm going in for the cream puff first. Okay, here All right, go. here we go. In three, two, right. one, puff. Puff, puff, puff. It's like puff, puff, puff. <laughs> puff the green, pass the green. Oh. Okay. Mm. That's actually really good. It is, the pastry is really light and flaky, like a nice cream puff would be. Mm. It has really good powdered sugar on it. And you've been nice little sweetness, and do not say anything after I say these words, Evan. There's a great little explosion of cream <coughs> um, <laughs> that comes out of the paper. All right, really that's, good. that's <laughs> enough. That's <laughs> enough. <laughs> Don't say anything. Family friendly uh, post here. Um, that's really good. So, highly, highly recommend the green tea matcha cream puff. And again, not super sweet. So, and this could be dangerous because the fact that it's not really sweet means you'll eat a lot. Mm. All right, so that's good. Green tea matcha, cream puff, that's a win. Okay. All right. Frappuccino. I would say uh, be careful of the straw. It's got like an angle. It does have an angle. It's like angle. a samurai. I'm myself. It's a samurai. Okay, song. now this looks like a shamrock thing. And if you watch my other tarot cards, you know I tried that. That was terrific. Okay. Here's hoping this is not that. All right, you want the countdown? Give me a countdown. All right, ready? Yeah. Tara tries a green tea matcha latte. Ready? Frappuccino. Frappuccino. Okay, here we go. All right, three, two, one. Right. Frapp. Uh. Oh, I see it going in. Okay. That is good, too. Hmm. That is really good. It's super refreshing. Yes, I'm giving that one a thumbs up. Super refreshing. It has a really nice flavor. I can't really describe the flavor, but it's really like um, kind of pistachio y. Oh, nice. It tastes like tea. And it's really good. And again, I go with it's not overly sweet, which is surprising that I like it because I tend to like overly sweet things. Um, hello, diabetes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but this is really, really good. So I would say. Green tea matcha, green tea matcha cream puffs. Yeah! Oh, so thanks to my friend Evan for encouraging me to try this. Oh yeah. This is a win. So now I can say the place. What's the name of this place? This is called uh, Cafe Maiko. Cafe Maiko in the Arboretum in Charlotte. Charlotte, Charlotte. Charlotte comes by the green tea frappuccino and the green tea pastry. Pastry, what are these? Green tea pastry. They're whatever. cream puffs. Cream puffs, thank you. Very good, such a win. Thank you for watching, and bye y'all. All right, we're gonna say arigato gozaimasu. You are